Hey guys, welcome back to the Show Merchant, and today I'm at Benali, and I've got a pretty exciting video. And for once, I'm actually more excited to be editing this video than I am to be riding it. And that is because I'm testing out different GoPro mounts, and I've got six mounts queued up. So I've got the chin mount, which I'm doing now. I've got a helmet mount on the top of the GoPro. I've got a front-facing chest mount a rear facing chest mount which you saw in Thursday's video um, sneak peek of that and I've got a bar mount and a weird one like sort of underneath the frame looking through at the forks I reckon that's going to be a pretty interesting one especially on the track that I've chosen it's a long central station really fun um, but yeah without Let's, uh, let's basically get into it. We're going to start with the uh, chin mount. So yeah, that was chin mount. Very nice, typical mount. That's the one that I usually use when I'm doing like uplifts or using the full face. Um, it's by far my favorite mount. You know, it's got this sort of stability of the head. And uh, um, yeah, the stability of the head, basically. And the angle of a, the angle of the, uh, chest which I think is the best so yeah definitely definitely like the edge uh, amount That is the head mount. <laughs> Doesn't work. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Do not like that mount. So yeah, dress mount. I like it. Very nice mount. It's one that I usually use when I'm doing most of my GoPro, like usual GoPro stuff, just around the local trails. And um, yeah, I like it. Good one. The only thing is the angle can be a little bit weird sometimes. Oh, I'm excited for the next one. Hard turn. Jesus. Oh my god. So yeah, that was a rear view. Really like that mount. I hope, hope, hope it was in the right place. Um yeah, I hope you like Max there. No idea what he did, but I shall soon find out in the editing sweet. Um but yeah. Rear is a really nice mount, I'm definitely going to use it more often. Now, on to everyone's least favourite mount, or especially my least favourite mount. So yeah, um, that was bar mount. Wasn't as bad as I thought it was. I might use that a little bit more, like... Yeah, that was, it was pretty decent actually. I did kind of like it. Now, this one, the next mount, is an experiment. I have no idea if it's gonna work, if it looks cool. I've done a tiny test, not riding it, just a tiny test. Seeing if it looks cool, and it did, but I have no idea what it's gonna look like on a trail actually riding. Hi. So yeah, that last mount worked so well until I just bombed out right on that sort of last jump. But whoo, that is a good, good, good mount. Oh my God. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna basically mash up all of the clips, uh, get it one full run down with um, 
the majority of the different camera angles some of them might not be in there because they're bad or boring um, but yeah let me know down in the comments which camera angle you think is the best I I know what mine is surprised me but I know what mine is uh, at least on this track um, yeah all right oh god I can't <laughs> I'm not in a good gear. Anyway, yeah, starting off. So this is the train mount. Love it, it's nice. Ooh. Typical mount. So that was a full rundown of, of all the different mashed up trails, uh, mashed up, mixed and matched camera angles. Can't talk, so I'm just gonna. God. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you. Oh my God. finish this video here thanks for watching um, if you like it you can go check out some of the other videos maybe think about subscribing if you want to and yeah I'll see you next time but until then keep shredding bye